package is being delivered. You can see some wheels. Keep y'all to Got some roaches. We ended up going with. I'll show y'all what we got going on. Got the tires. 255, 30, 26. So, we all locked in. We're ready. I'll show y'all what we got. Um, once I get everything unboxed. Alright, uh, I'm back. Uh, it started raining, so I had to bring everything inside. Show y'all a quick unboxing. Should I show y'all what we got? Show y'all right there. I ain't gonna tell you. I ain't gonna tell you what it is. You, they roots you without even you know. <laughs> These are called Ruchi Keys. Some of y'all might know what the, those are. But I'll uh, give y'all a quick unboxing of what we got. These are on the OBS. Um, my cousin, we just put in him an order. Uh, we're getting that C10 ready. I got, a, I got a video coming on that, update on the C10. I'm working on putting the LS swap in there. Um, but we're going to show y'all. Uh, my bad, I didn't realize what my camera was. Give y'all a, I'll go ahead and bust it open. As you can see. Ooh, I got the little, put a little thing off. That's how we coming. That's how we coming. How we coming. Ooh, how we coming? Yes, yeah, sir. So this the real. Um, it's gonna be hard, man. Floating caps. Gotta float the caps. Um, steering wheel, wheels, everything. So man, I'm happy. Look good. So I'm go with that. Got Ruchi, Ruchi keys. All right, man. Just a quick update. Um. Let me think uh, before I end this. Everything is good on this. Um, harness has been swapped over. I don't remember what I posted on my last video. I swapped the harness over. So literally the only thing I gotta do now, um, I gotta put my AC back on. I'm gonna take the little uh, the little U off right there for the um, off the water pump. And put it on the C10 over there. And then I gotta connect my I got them tied up right there, as you can see. Uh, heater core, got the heater core. I need to hook up right there, so that's quick and easy stuff. Um, only other thing I gotta do, as y'all can see, I don't know if you can see down there, but that's my exhaust. I already ran it from the back of. Uh, I got it. I got it tack welded in right now, but in a, in on a uh, jack stand. So I'm gonna run that up, and I'm gonna put like a. Um, Clamp. I got like a, a four inch. Excuse me, back y'all out. Got a four inch clamp, and I'm gonna uh, drop this down. Have the clamp probably in this range somewhere around there. Um, that way, the exhaust is separate. I'm not gonna weld the whole thing, but connect that down pipe, and then literally after that, I'm ready for a tune. I'm ready to go. Uh, I just really I ain't done that because um, I've been jumping back and forth between the two trucks. Um, so trying to get my cousin's uh, truck ready and then my truck ready. Um, got the interior pieces for it at the new seat. Um, I'm going to show you all that, but I'll show you all a, a quick um, little shot of the um, dashboard. So it's going to be going to be this color on the inside. All the all the materials being wrapped. Um, so that's just a quick update on that. Well, I guess I'll go ahead and show you all where we are right here on this one. Um, Put the motor in transmission. It's uh 4080. I said not 480, excuse me. 60, not 480. It's um hold on, give me one second. Alright, 60. It's not an 80 e Probably say you want to go to an 80E at some point. Right now we're gonna stick with the uh 700R that's in here. It's got rebuilt and everything um before he got it painted. Um so pretty much this is where we are right now on this. Um, harness is in the inside. Uh, I got the coolant, coolant hooked up. I got the, um, the fuel lines already ran. Everything's ran to the uh, pump. I'm waiting on his fuel, fuel, fuel pressure regulator to come in. Mount that on the uh, back wall. 
The return line is already down in front of the truck. I have the fuel pump um, uh, wire. It's going, I'm gonna run that up here as well. I get done this week and then put the harness on. He does have to get me um, a core pack harnesses because I, I don't know if y'all seen these kind of on, um, on Amazon. Uh, he bought these and I don't know, I ain't fucking with them uh, really. Um, I had some issues with uh, the one I call myself using these on my truck and all I did make my, make my truck uh, backfire. Didn't really feel like testing wires and going through all the shit with that. So I just said hell with it. Just get some stock ones and uh, go go with it from there. Um, other than that, that's pretty much where we are. I got the automotive oil, uh, coolant, everything ready to go. I got the fan harness already ready. I'm not I'm not exactly sure where I'm going to mount this. Um, where I'm going to mount his uh, computer at. I may mount it on the inside and run it, run it through. Um, but I'm not 100%. I may just mount it over here. Haven't haven't decided. I may just mount it over there in that corner. Just be done with it. Just finish the swap. Um, but other than that, it's really pretty much straightforward build. Nothing crazy. Um, I do have to get uh, another kick down cable because it's kicked down. I don't know, I'm about to see if this kick down cable will work. I don't think it will. I believe that was one of the things. This kick down cable for his 700 um, R is not long enough. So I'll get another. Probably get like another low car one, kind of like how that one is. Run that up. I'm trying to think what else I need for this truck. That's it. Fuel pressure regulator, harness on the inside. I've got to get a battery. And um, oh yeah, <laughs> fucking intake, intake. Um, quarter intake is in there. I got to put that on. Uh, we need a bigger. Cause a, he bought the one oh two millimeter uh, throttle body. So the one that we had that came with the pipe, it, it uh, cracked, so it didn't didn't fit. So he ordered that. Other than that, it's gonna be a pretty clean build though. Um, I am gonna scuff it up under here and throw some, uh, some probably some satin black paint up under here just to touch on and make it look fresh. I have the wires. It's a simple build, so I'm gonna have all the wires nice and neat. re them and then uh, other than that, I'll be ready to hit the streets here soon. But that's the update on both of these trucks. Um, about to go in here and look at my wheels again. I am kind of happy. So, um, other than that, I do have to paint my bumper again because, as you see, um, I didn't. This is at my old house in Florida. I didn't back the truck in all the way, and it. Um, I let the garage down, and then it knocked my paint off my uh, bumper, but. Other than that, I ain't, I've been rambling. I'm not gonna go too long. I just want, I just want to bring y'all a quick update on where we are with the bills, and um, that's pretty much what we got. We should in this next month, we should be, uh, should be outside. So, other than that, yeah, another look at the wheels. 26 inch Rucci keys going on the LVS. So it's gonna be uh, all black with the, um, with the chrome lip. All right, peace. Mm -hmm.